<laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, and you too, Chaz, wherever the hell you are. Oh, he's actually stuck down in the basement. You know, I left some reds out. I think he had a stroke again, you know. So. No, we don't want to know what Chad is stroking. Anyway, thank you for coming <laughs> to WAW Aftermath. I, of course, am Matt Bishop. I am joined on the commentating table tonight by Mr. No Gimmicks, Alex Jace, who... Uh, no Gimmicks Needed. Thank no you. gimmicks needed, Thank Alex you. Jace, who uh, is sporting a bit of a gimmick tonight. Oh, yeah, as actually, his arm that is looks not a hurt. gimmick. Actually, that is not a gimmick. That is actually a separated shoulder, thanks to Rocco and his dumbass. Well, we're going to be seeing Rocco tonight. We're going to be seeing Troy Garbo, Gino Dynamides. You know what? I can't even run down the card. It's going to be so good. Let's take it to Pete and get this party started with a bang. Welcome to WAW Aftermath. show with a lumberyard match. Anything made out of wood is legal. Entry first, heading from Hell, Michigan, it's the Raging Demon, Carnage! All right, here we are, back from Newton, back from WAW, unequaled, and of course on that night... Here comes that stupid caveman. Yeah. Caveman! Bunga bunga! Bunga bunga bunga! Hey, careful, you'll attract his attention. Not happy, of course. Oh, he gonna, never looks happy when no, you talk No, about. he doesn't, but he's Unless there he to put the meat. end to Rocco. He'll be happy when he has good. dead meat. Uh -oh. oh, he's talking. Uh oh, oh no. dead meat. So why aren't you people congratulating your new number one contender? Because you suck. Thank you. I will go on a hellbound. I will become the WWE champion. Despite who's champion, I don't care. I have plans at hellbound. But until then, I have a few loose strings to cut. Rocco, you want to around free? Fine, you got it. One more yard match. Anything made of wood is legal. 100% legal. You got anything downstairs you want to bring up made of wood? You find anything underneath the ring? I'll bet I don't care. Go outside. Get something made of wood. I don't care. It's legal. All I know is you are not walking out of this match. <laughs> I know his mom knows I got some wood for him. Yeah, so. Bring it on, big man. Uh, strong words by, of course, the Raging Demon, and here we have the King and of Violence. you know violence. what, though? Mm -hmm. This is just giving me a, an example to talk about the downfall of professional wrestling here oh, because of these hardcore wrestling matches that are destroying the way wrestling is nowadays. Well, what this is he trying to do? When he's he's trying to get in the ring is what he's trying to do, oh. and this match may be off to before it, the bell rings. And hold on, Carnage work starting to work with those, uh, those, what are those? A kendo those, stick? It's a kendo oh stick. Oh my god. Oh, if he's going to hit him with it, hit him harder than that. Come on. Wait, did you just say this is what's causing the downfall of wrestling? If you're going to do it, do it right though. Okay. However, Rocco, no stranger to violence, and here we go. Oh boy. Oh, Rocco. I thought you were, you know, Mr. Violent. Oh, come well, on. Well, Carnage right not feeling well after that. And Rocco, of course, lights Stelina tonight. She's going to be in a match later on. And Rocco now going to work. They're just playing with sticks. This I don't want to know about what Carnage, what sticks Carnage plays with, but... Out of the um, Ho, ho, ho. Way to hurt my shoulder. Oh, I'm going to hit you with a German suplex. And no, oh, I'm going to fall on my head. Uh, yeah, way to go, buddy. Way to go. Uh, Rocco now. Oh, that has an or? Or what? <laughs> or it looks like it hurts. Uh, I don't know. Uh, Rocco Ro sucks. Rocco sucks. Rocco sucks. Uh, he better step up his game here as Carnage now working what on game? it. What Rocco doesn't have any game. No, Rocco has a. Oh! He's not gonna have any game after that. Oh my god. He's making this weekend bad for Stelina, let me tell Ooh. you. <laughs> after I broke her back. Yeah. We At Apocalypse. Aren't gonna discuss that. <clears throat> Do you know why I did that? No, but I bet you're gonna tell us. I'm telling you right now that if I knew that Rocco was gonna win that match, that it was gonna be crazy violent, it was gonna be 
making this place horrible. It was gonna be okay. Now hold on a second, Alex Chase. This is Rocco. This is the king of violence. The Halloween Halloween Hellraiser. How can you go into a match and not expect violence? And speaking of which, Carnage now breaking those wooden beams Ow. over Rocco's back. Owie. Yes. Uh oh. So Shut up, Carnage. And what I'm trying to say is that if Rocco won that match. It would have been some type of trick or treat or trick or treat 23. I don't know how many of matches of those he's done, but they just are retarded. Uh, wait, they wait, make, wait a minute, one, two. They make this make this wrestling company look like the craps. Okay, I would rather. Well, speaking of craps, I think see, it's a normal a wrestling so. match one on one. Okay. Well, unfortunately, Alex, I'm afraid you're in the minority. As you can hear the audience now chanting, well, the wanting to get the, the, the fans here. are complete idiots. They are chocolateites. Excuse me. They are complete. They are chocolateites. They are the ones who come. They're the ones who you. cheer for John Cena. Okay. They're the ones who cheer for Rocco. And cheer they do as Rocco now. All these fans are to wrestling companies are pieces of meat to pay for their merchandise. They're the reason you're out here. Merchandise. Oh. Merchandise. Uh, can we save the, the philosophical uh, discussion for, uh, for after the match? As Carnage. Oh, oh, oh my God. Oh, Rocco, Rocco, Rocco deserved that. In your opinion. Rocco deserved that. But Rocco, as I have said before, and I will say again, the man can take an amazing amount of use. He Rocco likes pain. Rocco is crazy to have broken my shoulder and messed up my shoulder that way. Because once I heal up, he is done. He is done. He is going to tap out. I am going to choke him out. I am going to destroy uh -oh. Rocco. Well, you're going to have to get through this first. Rocco getting wound up here. Coming off the apron. And, oh, gets his legs taken out from under him. Carnage. Hurt his neck. Go for the neck. I don't think Carnage. Oh, don't go for the legs. I don't think Carnage needs any Who help. Who cares for the legs? No, so Carnage does is now sets him over. Half crab, Half crab with the crab. stick. And again, hey Rocco, how about you tap out, huh? Tap, oh, tap, tap. Rocco. Well, again, this is a no dick. Oh, Rocco's having the Rocco's having the hard time getting up. Carnage now with the He's doing some yard work. I don't think Carnage is good at that. He's not even Mexican either, so. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> I'll remind you that the Pure Arturo Division champion is Puerto Rican, so try to keep it down there on that front, huh? You oh, know? that's fine. You know, he can, you know, keep his belt, and he can wear it while he mows my grass, so. <laughs> I got to ask, Chase, what happened to you? Huh? What happened to you? You've, you've got such a chip on your shoulder I blame lately. Your, I blame you. I blame all these people in the crowd. Uh. Okay. They've de downgraded what wrestling used to be. Wrestling is not what it used to be. I'm trying to bring it back to where it should be. Uh, Rocco getting brought where he thinks, it, where Carnage thinks he should be. Running him into that lattice and uh-oh. Oh. Setting up ahead of steam incoming. Oh. Wow. Owie. Owie. And Rocco now fired up the crowd behind him. And again, the king of violence, the Halloween Hellraiser, just picking his weapons. You can hit him, you can beat him, you can make him bloody, but he still keeps coming at you. I had fell down on Rocco. Oh, that didn't work. Choke Rocco. And now Rocco, doing, head Rocco? of steam coming in. Oh, and he's trying to do his, my old cannonball. And that's why you don't do the cannonball. Well, a bit of a misfire. Because you're just going to kill yourself. If you know you're going to hit the cannonball, make sure you're absolutely sure you're actually going to hit it. It's one of those hit or miss. Once you miss that thing, you're going to die. No, Rocco ain't dead yet. He's maybe a little uh, wounded and the cans letting their opinion be known. Rocco has no brains. He doesn't. Oh! Wow. Of course, neither does Carnage. Guys, got guys, a couple brain cells short a pair, but he knows how to get the job done. Breaking that stick over Rocco's head. He deserved it. Yes, I'm aware you are of that opinion. <clears throat> oh, I'm definitely aware of that opinion. The fans, though, they want to they want to see Rocco get up. They're trying to get him fired up. King of nothing. He is a king of nothing. 
He is the queen of violence. Queen? No, that's Delina. Nope, he's, they're both queens of violence. Both queens of violence? He's sure. just the drag queen of violence. Drag, drag queen of violence. I don't, I'm gonna tell him you said that. <laughs> I will. I'll tell that someone's face. I don't care. And, whoa, 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 wait a minute. Hold That's on, hold legal. on. That is not legal in this match. Although anything on the outside of the ring, the ref has no jurisdiction over. So. Right, but this is supposed to be a lumberyard match. He Doesn't cannot matter. hit Rocco ref, with those chairs. The referee chairs. cannot do anything about it. And Carnage, oh no. Carnage has an idea. This is not You good. know, I'm really done right now. What? What What do you mean? What do you mean you're done? Re Alex Chase. Alex Chase. What? Where is Alex Chase going? What is going on here? Wait a minute. He's supposed to be on the commentating table with me at... Oh, come on! Oh, come on! Mr. No Gimmicks Needed. Mr. Says, oh, wrestling should be pure. It shouldn't be hardcore. Just hit Rocco with powder. Hypocrite. Rocco out, can't see, blinded, and Carnage now capitalizing. Oh no, 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 no. Pump handle slam! Oh god! Oh my god, no. No, not like this. Two! Carnage picks up a win with some uh, assistance by Mr. No Gimmicks. And now Stalina rushing to their boyfriend's help, Rocco's help. And, come on, Carnage. Just because you can't get a girl, you can't deny Rocco. And, wait a minute. What is, what is Alex Jace no, got to no. say? That was for breaking and basically separating my shoulders this past week. Okay. You know, I wasn't gonna throw powder in your face like I did last week, but you know, you, you hurt me. Shut up. So you know, Rocco. You have something to say? I don't have something to say, okay? I don't want to play this. You say, I say bullshit every week like being carved shit. I see you ain't all about it. I got a solution. I don't want this no gimmicks needed out shit shit. I want that foolproof ultra violent Joey Staple. I want him to be the king of violence at Hellbound. Whoa. And, and the match will be Boston Massacre. Yeah. Whoa. You know, just a couple of years ago, Rock, I probably would have accepted that, but you know what? No way. Oh, come on. What do you want to get to this match? Rocco, don't you know I do things my way? Everything I do is my way, not your way, not their way, the people in the crowd. Okay. No, you're the loser. I'm not the bad guy, you're the bad guy. You're the bad guy too, Rocco. For supporting these people in their habitat for violence. No, Rocco, but you know what? If you want your match, your little Boston Massacre. I think they want it too, Rocco. Shut up. You know, and if you want this match, you're gonna have to do it my way. What is your way? So, when I'm actually feeling better, because you know you separated my shoulder, so give me a couple weeks. Well, the best of three series. Fine, I accept. Well, there you have it. Best of three. Alex Jace calling out Rocco. Rocco accepting. And a best of three. Uh, Rocco's going to need two, and I mean feet, to get out of here. Stalina, of course, supporting him. What a way to start our first aftermath back from Newton, of course. And we got more fun to come.
Entry first from somewhere in Chicago land. It's Hex. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are ready to roll here. Second match of the night. We have the Hexcellence of Hexecution. Member of the Insane Clown Posse, the uh, Inner City Posse, ICP, Hex. And I, of course, am uh, partnerless. I don't know where Chad is. And his opponent hails from all of Italy. All of Italy. It's Italy. Oh my god. Well, if anybody would cover all of Italy, it would be this man, Sister Mary Francis. I don't know what Hex was thinking except in this, but that man, mountain of a man. All right, there we go. We have the monster, Little Italy versus Hex. And Hex trying to get the crowd going here. Lock up and... Good God! Big man get ahead of steam. Big clothesline. Taking Hex apart. And good God! I think, he, I think he almost made it into orbit with that one. Hex, big clothesline. Oh, my God. Just end this. And up. Oh my no. Oh no. Choking him out. And choke slam. That's it. That's it. Oh, doesn't even. One, two. What? What? And crush. Oh my god. No. Wait a minute. Oh my god. And Hex tapping out. I haven't seen that move since the days. Since that day's a crush. And Hex. Alright, anybody who's listening in the back room right now, make sure this man gets a sandwich. Holy mackerel.